Hello students, here is the intro video for Spelling Unit 34. So the words this week, I always like to, the first thing to do is go down to the bottom here on that first page, and this is on page 222. The remember part kind of gives us a little bit of an intro. This is about Greek roots of words. And so we have four different Greek roots that are being used this week. The first one is meter which means measure. So a thermometer measures heat. We'll get down to thermo in a minute here. Graph means write. L-O-G-Y to speak or to study. And thermo meaning heat. So we can use those base pieces to help us figure out definitions of words. So what are the words for this week? Autobiographer, speedometer, thermometer, photography, oceanographer, biographer, paragraph, geographer, thermostat, geography, diameter, thermal, autograph, graphic, barometer, geology, biology, geologist, telegraph, and geometry. Now, one of the things that I hope you notice as you're going through this is that suffix er and remember we talked about the suffix er or or added to a word oftentimes tells us one who does something so an autobiographer would be one who writes a story about themselves all right one word that i thought in here that you might have a little bit of trouble with would be barometer Barometer is a tool used to measure um, things in the weather. It helps um, the, the weatherman help figure out what's going to be happening with the weather. They can remember, they can measure different types of pressures and such in the atmosphere. Okay, so that is the first page. It's simply a sort that should be pretty easy. It's based on these um, Greek roots that we have. On to page 223. The first section says write spelling words to match these definitions. Okay, so then we have the definitions, and if you're not familiar with some of those words, you may have to look them up, and that's okay. You can do that. Again, process of elimination. So do the pieces of the page that make sense first. You can skip down to this part if it's helpful to you. The second part, word structure. Match a word part from group A with group B to spell the word. And that would be, I think, a great place to start. And then the dictionary section at the bottom, um, they're talking about the Greek roots. Again, use you know your skills and the information from the previous page and checking off your word list to help you eliminate possibilities on this page. Okay, on to page 225. The first section is complete the analogies. Write the spelling word to complete each analogy. Um, let me see which one we should go through here. Let's do number two. Animal is to zoologist. So a, zo a zoologist would be somebody who would work with animals. And a rock is to, so we need the person, the name of the person, who would be likely to work with rocks or study rocks. And so it would be the geologist. Okay, that one should help you a little bit. Making inferences, write a spelling word to complete each sentence. Number eight, we hired a blank design artist to illustrate the book. A good person to do that would be a graphic design artist. And then the context clues on the bottom, there are five more words there you can eliminate from your choices for the previous 15 problems. And then the last page, finding those misspelled words. All right, students, that is Unit 34. Make sure you complete your work with this. And then on Friday, take your spelling test and complete the assignment on Edmodo. If you have questions on specific words or get really stumped, you can either get a hold of me or save it for our Wednesday night Zoom meeting.